Hello everyone, I'm the old guy and welcome back to my Let's Play of Fallout 2. This is episode 35 and we are in the stables near New Reno. And down this manhole right here we met the creator of the drug Jet, Myron. He is, his lab is downstairs. And this up here is where they do the experiments with uh, Brahmin and people. These are mass murderers, and the Mordino family is funding them, and it has put us in a little bit of a dilemma. I don't think we're strong enough to actually just kill everybody in here. So, I'm going to go back and talk to Big Jesus and see what he says. I may have to win his trust first. I'm not sure. He's a very sick man. I wonder if there'll be a chance that we can kill him. I'm not sure. Oh, right out of the bat, we get some mobsters. I don't think we have upset any mobsters yet. And this is what I mean. Traveling with these guys around, that's a pretty difficult group. If we make them upset, I'm sure they will attack us. It is getting interesting. Let's go to Virgin Street and talk to Big Jesus. It's nighttime. Let's wait until morning. We are wounded as well. <laughs> 16. Yeah, we are wounded. We did get some super stims off Myron, though, which is good. Let's go talk to Big Mordino and find out. Yeah, see, he's got guards all over the place. These guys are, you know, heavily packed, I'm sure. I don't think we can beat all of these people. Let's be nice to him for now. Have you done as I asked? See, this is interesting. We can confront him right now, or we can tell him about Ramirez being addicted to Jet. I'm sure he knows this. I'm just going to play along with him for now. Let's see if we have the opportunity to maybe kill him while he's by himself. I'm not sure. Yes, I delivered it to Ramirez as you asked. Very well. Here is your payment. A hundred chips for a simple delivery it is more than enough thank you senor mordino i have more work for you i need someone to collect my percentage from the corsican brothers they are late in their payments i will go there now senor mordino head north up virgin street they are across from the gym if they give you trouble if they make excuses hurt them very well senor mordino oh okay hopefully something will present itself here because i am not sure how to handle this situation maybe as we do missions and explore the city something will become available to us idea so the gym is right here the jungle gym so i take it that the corsican brothers are in here or are they up in here go into the Golden Globes porn studio here. Of course, can brothers, here they are. So this bodyguard you see one of the Corsican brothers. Where's the other one? 
But let's go in here and talk to him. The Corsican brothers at your service. You the new fluffer? I wonder if you could become a porn star here? Uh, there's a lot of choices. But I don't want to really fool around with uh, that kind of stuff. Um, no, I'm here for Big Jesus Mordino's money. Um, sure, sure. Sure, sorry about the misunderstanding. Here you go. 250 chips. And, uh, say hello to Big Jesus for me, okay? Before you're all quick to run me out of here, why don't you tell me about your little operation, Slick? The Golden Globe Studio, the studio for all talent in what remains of the world. So, uh, what can I do for you today? How do you film? I mean, come on, you'd need cameras, film, projectors. Where do you get all that stuff? We lucked out, we don't need any of that stonage crap. We stumbled across a working porno, er, hollow, graphic projector. No bulky equipment, no fuss, and no unsightly mess. We can ask for a job at the porno. Become a porn star? <laughs> oh, that's tempting. Let's, let's try this. I see. Well, look, I'm interested in the job, if you're still offering. All right, then. Head to the back, start waxing the shafts. Here's your pay, five chips. <laughs> oh my goodness, no, I'm backing out. Um, actually, I changed my mind, no thanks. I'd best be going now. <laughs> That's funny. All right, let's go see what the big man's got to say, big Jesus. Let's go talk to Big Jesus. See what he's got to say. Have you done as I asked? Yes. Here's the money. Here. Half. Is yours. Hey. They had already paid me this month, but I like to keep them. On their toes. Thank you, Signor Mordino. I have one last job for you. There. Is a man who must die. Who is this man you wish dead, Senor Mordino? This man, Luis Salvatore. He has killed many of my men. Many proud men of the Mordino family. He butchered them in the street like dogs. It is my will that this man die. Let's keep playing along with him for now, and then we'll talk to Luis Salvador and see what's going on there. This is a good excuse, so let's do this one. I will see the Mordino family avenge, Senor Mordino. I will return when I have completed the task. That is good. The man is old. A cripple. He hides in his bar, Salvatore's, near the Bishop Casino. He is a coward and never leaves his room upstairs. When he is dead, return. I will be back when he is dead, Senor Mordino. Now we've got 500 experience. Hmm. Let's see. Let's go to the Salvador's and find out what he's all about. We are still very wounded too. We do have some super stims and a bunch of stim packs actually. We're doing all right for that. But I think the Salvador's is right here. Salvador's bar. Let's go and see.
one of Salvatore's men. Let's go talk to the bar here. Talk to the bartender and see. This one was a man. Let's talk to the bartender. What's your poison, pal? What kind of chems do you have? Yeah. I don't think he's going to tell us anything. And... Let's talk to this guy. Can I help you? Let's go up here. You see Mason. You done walking in the wrong place, tribal. Get. What's behind that door? Behind that door? That door right there? Why, that's Mr. Salvatore's room. Now beat it. Look. Do you still want to have your job tomorrow? I have some info about one of the other families in Reno that Mr. Salvador is going to want to hear. So let me speak to him now. Excuse me, Mr. Salvador. This is Mason. This man says he's got something you want to hear. Mr. Salvador says you may come in. Thanks. I'll be sure to mention your manners to Mr. Salvador. Look, some ground rules, boy. Don't waste Mr. Salvatore's time, and don't give him any bullshit, where you answer to me. Understood. I ain't done yet. You show him respect. You call him Mr. Salvatore at all times, and when he talks, you shut up and listen. Understand? Understood. Let's go through. Oh, this is getting intense right now. Let's talk to Mr. Salvador here. What do you want of me? I have information for you, Mr. Salvador. You have nothing that I need to know. Now, what do you want of me? Mr. Salvador, you have the reputation for strength and fairness. I want to work for you. Of course. But I require a token of your good faith. A sample of your willingness to work for me. What would you have me do, Mr. Salvador? There is a man who has used his skill with cards to rob me. The sum is trivial. The insult is not. I want him killed and the money he stole returned. Who is this thief? Mason will have the details. Go now? Thank you, Mr. Salvador. I'll go ask Mason. Alright, let's talk to Mason. Let's play along with this guy now. About time you showed, boy. This bum that stole from Mr. Salvatore, his name's Lloyd. Mr. Salvatore wants him dead and that money he stole back. When you done the job, report back to me, understand? Think you can handle that? Where can I find Lloyd? He's been laying low, so tracking him down's gonna be your job, boy. Best bet? Check some of the bars along Virgin Street. Lloyd might be running another hustle there. That's all I need to know. Thanks, Mason. Alright. Let's... Down on Virgin Street, I think they said. Let's check the Pip-Boy real quick. Pretty Boy Lloyd. Alright. Who is Pretty Boy Lloyd? And where could he be hiding? Down on Virgin Street, they said. It's a 
down here. Alright, let's try to find him. Desperados first. Rodino's men. How do you get in that room? Well, there's a door right there. Dimordino's man, one of Dimordino's man. There's a stairway. Maybe he's. Let's go over here. I don't think we've been in the basement yet. Oh. Pretty boy Floyd. There he is. Let's go talk to him and see what he has to say. to be locked. Okay, let's lockpick this. You have picked the lock. Who are you? What are you doing down here? You Lloyd? Pretty boy Lloyd? Maybe. Who are you? I don't believe I've had the pleasure. Lloyd, Mr. Salvador sent me here to get his money back and have me make an example of you. It doesn't need to be that way if the two of us can come to an agreement. Hmm. An arrangement, you say? All right, all right. What is it you want? I get you out of town in exchange for all the money you won from Mr. Salvador, Lloyd. Well, now? Hmm. Seems I got no choice. I'm going to have to take you to where the money is, though, cause you won't find it otherwise. Let's go. I'm right behind you. Here we are. Phew, the money's in, this grave here. Dig it up, Lloyd. Ah. There's two types of people in this world, Lloyd. Those with loaded guns, and those that dig. Nice one, Lloyd. Keep digging. Let's see what else is under there. Old fallout shelter. Open the manhole, Lloyd. Get in there, Lloyd. I'm coming down after you, Lloyd. Oh, he's attacking me. No. Oh, my goodness. I didn't heal up. We're going to have to use a... Let's use a super stim. Which I didn't want to do that. Let's get him. was killed. Okay, Lloyd is dead. Let's... He could have escaped Lloyd. Let's take all his money. Let's take this rope. He can keep the shovel and his shotgun. I will take it. And what do we have here? Any experience points? There's no mines or traps now. Thousand. All right, there is Salvador's money. Very cool. You shouldn't have attacked me there, Lloyd. Crazy place. Get out of here. see let's go to new reno uh oh what do we got 
Nothing? Oh, wait a second. There was someone talking to us there, and I think they're standing there. All right, let's go talk to Mr. Salvador. I believe he's right here. Salvador, let's go. He's upstairs. Let's talk to him. Let's better talk to uh, Mason here first. You found Lloyd yet? Yeah, I found Lloyd. Well, all right then. Go tell Mr. Salvatore what you found. All right. Let's talk to Lewis. Have you disposed of the thief? Yes. I made an example of him, Mr. Salvador. And the money. Has it been recovered? Yes, Mr. Salvador. I will take the money now. I'm going to give him the whole whack. The remaining half is yours. Thank you, Mr. Salvador. I have another matter that requires your attention. I'm interested in the job, Mr. Salvador. What do you want me to do? A constituent in my district has not paid me tribute for the services I provide. Collect it. If he objects, inform him you are my representative in this matter. Talk to Mason for the details. Yes, Mr. Salvador. I'll go see him. All right, let's talk to... Oh, we got 500 experience points for that. Let's go talk to Mason. All right, then. You're going to be a one-man collection agency. Drill simple. Visit Renesco's pharmacy on Commercial Row. Collect the tribute. 1,000 chips. Then bring it back here. All right. Anything else? Don't let Gramps give you any bullshit. If he does, tell him you work for Mr. Salvatore. That should clear up any misunderstandings. You got that? That's all I needed to know. Thanks, Mason. Alright, and we're going to continue this mission in the next episode. So thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you soon.